Good morning, everyone. My name is Eltamar, and we're going to be continuing our Let's Play of Hogwarts Legacy, where we left off last time. We were exploring the world, doing some of the stuff. Uh, I went and got some new animals to drop off here. We got some Thestrals. Actually, I think we're going to put the Thestrals in the swamp. Although, I think the Toads also deserve to go in the swamp. So, we'll put the Thestrals here. This is fine. Uh, we got three Thestrals. I picked them all up. We're going to throw them all into here. And we're going to brush them all. They'll go feed themselves. Everyone needs to be pet. And then we can get a bunch of materials. We're going to need a lot more animals to do enchanting later on, but we're getting some. I also have some toads. I'm going to start collecting animals as we go, because we're going to need so many of them. One, two... Where's my third jabbernal? Over there. You. Oh, you haven't eaten yet. Go eat something. Alright, where's my puffskins? One, two... Here's three, but you haven't... Oh, that's a moon cap. Where's my third puff skein? Where is my third puff skein? Oh, there you are. Alright. Moon cap hasn't eaten, so one... Oops. One? No, you still haven't eaten yet either. You guys gotta eat faster, come on. Okay, Thestrals, one. You haven't eaten. Two, you've eaten... Yes. All my moon calf's done. We're missing one moon calf. And we're missing what? A jabbernol, I think, from earlier. Oh, that Thestral's finally done. That Thestral still isn't eaten. Go eat. I need your sweet, sweet stuff. Thestral fur or feathers or something? I don't know what they give. Okay, well, you're done, moon calf. No, not you. Could you move Thestral? I'm really just trying to get the fur here. Okay, I think we just have the one Thestral left. Alright, good. We're gone. Wait, wasn't there a Jabbernol we missed? Did we get that finally? One, two, three puff skeins. One, two... What's a moon calf? Also a moon calf? Where's my last Jabbernol? Did I get all the Mooncalfs? I believe I got all the Mooncalfs and all the Thestrals. I'm just not sure about the Jabbernols. There's one. That's another. Is that one? Or is that the one we just scanned? No, there's two there. Okay, one. Two. I still don't know where my third Jabbernol is, but I don't care that much. Let's just go. I like how Moonstone spawns in a place that requires a Moonstone to do anything. Honestly, where is my... Oh, there's my last Jabbernol. Or no, those are those two. I'm convinced one of the Jabbernols is just gone. There's two flying around and... Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm just blind. Jesus. Alright, let's get out of here. Anyways, we've done the stuff. I'm going to see if... The reason that I started the video here is because I think... No, nope, we haven't hit the part of the game where the uh, vivarium expands. Oh, we can't get any more shiny. We should probably use some of our consumables during um, combat. Or at least maybe change them out because it's kind of wasted spots right there, isn't it? We're going to head to Hogsmeade really quickly because I'm going to get all of the pages for this place, the field guide pages for this place in this video. So what we're going to do, but first we're going to stop off at a little known shop. An honest day. Which is not that little known and it's actually just, you know, the shop where we get all the spell crafts. There's a couple things I want to buy. We don't need money Let's right now, so, we have, shall we? or at least we don't need too much. We'll grab the toy box because it's fun. Nothing like Dumb composter, right sure, thing, why not? Uh, hopping spell, pot spellcraft, those are good. They can make potions for you, but I gotta make sure we get the ones we want. Don't necessarily need these yet. The material refinery, produce moonstone. Okay, yeah. Okay, Nothing and like then, so how much money do we have? We have 12,000, so 1, 1,700, 32, 50, 62, 50, 62, 650. Okay, we should be good. 
Nothing like just want to make sure we have all the, the money right for all the spellcrafts that we're just going to buy. And you might be wondering, like, if you're never going to use the five small pot potions, why are you bothering to grab this? There is a very easy reason for that. There's a thing called collections, and there's an achievement if you fill these all in. So I want to do that. It's a lot of work, though. There's so many things to find in this game. But anyways, that's why we're buying all those, because you do need them as a part of the collection thing. Revelio. I'm going to make sure we got all the stuff, or all the pages from in here first. It looks like we got that one. There's a page that flies up near the top. In fact, you can see it right there. Uh, there's two ways you can go about getting it. You can just Accio it. There's also this little book here on the right. Or on the left, I should say. If you press it, it opens up this staircase. You can come up here, and then you can just easily Accio it from here. Accio. But more importantly, there's also a chest up here. But we already got that earlier, so obviously we've done this before. And we're leaving. So, next one. Rebellion. There is a one that's usually right in front of the store. We've already gotten it, apparently. I'm going to grab this chest while I'm here. Because we spent a ton of money, and we need all the money we can possibly get. There's a bunch in this area, so we're just going to go grab potentially another one if I haven't gotten it already. I don't remember if we got this one or not. We got this one. Perfect. I think we got the one that's flying around this area. Excellent. Is There's another one that flies around this area as well. Unless we've already Rebellion. gotten it. Looks like we got it. Great. This is going very easily and smoothly so far. Actually, you know what? How many pages do we need? It'll inform how much... Oh, we've got... We only got two left in here? Oh, damn. Okay, I think I know where one of them is. Possibly I know where two of them are. We already have almost all the field guide pages. I shouldn't go through all these then. So the Hogshead's one, but we've already gotten that one. We did a really good job clearing out the field guide pages in this place. Aside from, you know, Rebellion. a couple we missed. There's also a locked door over there. Guessing we got the bridge one. It's one of the easier ones to find. Move. Alohomora. There's not a page in here. I'm just uh, checking to make sure we don't uh, miss any loot. I'm honestly surprised we've already got 53 out of the 55 pages for this place. We did a wonderful job collecting them the first time through. Revelio. Give me your sweet, sweet stuff. The chest outside, I think so. It's also a... Uh, Disillusionment chest, so we are going to get some $500 out of it, and that is going to be great for us. We are very, very poor. And by that I mean extremely. Where the hell's the door? There it is. Disillusionment ourselves. Head around to the side here. Chest is right there. Have we already gotten this one? We sure have not. There's a page up there. That's one of the ones we're missing. And I think I have an idea where the lot. Oh, Alright, I can't fly. If, I, if this is where the last one is, then we're actually done with pages. We can move on with stuff. These pages in Hogsmeade, so. Uh, the one I think we missed is in the Beast Shop. I'm pretty sure, if I had to hazard a guess. That would be the one that I would assume is the one we've missed. There's the Beast Shop right there. That's a bird. I was like, wait a minute, is there a page flying around there? But sometimes it's just birds. There is one that's over here in this corner. Rebellion. But it is not the one we miss. No, no, I don't know which one we missed. Maybe up the, by the wind, the uh, water wheel. There's another one. And there's also one by the um, poison ear shop that it could be as well. Not seeing the one up here, so I'm Rebellion. gonna go ahead and say it's not this one. I'll check the poisoner shop, and then there's one more place I think that we might have missed if it's not the poisoner shop. It is not, but there is a chest there we missed, so we might as well grab that. Is that a uh, disillusionment? Yes, it is. If it's not this one, I don't know which one it is, and we might have to go searching around, and I'll just do a cut, a jump cut till we get to it. 
That's a bird again, damn it. Why are there so many birds? The one that I think it might be, actually we should just take the blue. There's no point in running the whole way. Is the one in the forest down there. I don't know if we missed that one, but we might have. And if we did, that'd be great. And if we didn't, then I'm going to go searching around through every single spot that I remember to try and figure out which one we've missed. We also... Oh, wait. Did we do the butter... Yeah, I think we did the butterfly. Hogsmeade, here I come. That was a terrible jump. There's a page that flutters around here. Revelio. But we've already gotten it, apparently. There's a chest over there, though. Let's go grab that. Is that a disillusionment chest? It's hard to tell from a distance, and it is... Yes. Levioso. Not Levioso. Okay, I'm going to go search around for chests. I think that it could be possibly a moth puzzle we haven't done yet. Although I'm not 100% sure about that. Regardless, I'm going to figure out which one we're missing and then go grab it. And then we can continue on our adventure. Hang tight. I'll be right back. Alrighty, so after a fairly significant amount of wandering around, we found the last one. It's actually in the post office. Magical mail. These shoots in the post office magically sort various bits of mail. The post office itself houses, houses over 200 owls, color-coded based on how quickly a particular letter or parcel needs to be delivered. And actually, if we go outside, it is a pretty cool looking building. If we look up, there's a whole like owlery situation going on. Can we Accio one? Accio. Yes, but they don't really do anything. Okay, so we have successfully obtained all the things. We are actually still missing a collection chest, however, in this town somewhere, but we'll come back for that, I think. We'll be wandering around the town enough times that I'm sure we'll pick it up at some point. I'm sure it's in like a level three locked Rebellion. door that we just haven't gotten to yet. I guess we can do... We'll do a once-over of the town really quickly. There's a chest. Oh, it's already an open chest. That's not the one we're looking for. Revelio ever so often. That's already an open one. It's probably going to be on, like, the hinterlands of town. And if it's not around immediately, we'll just head out. We got things to do. What is that? Oh, it's another chest. We already got that one. I'm going to head over to these houses. They're the most likely culprits or suspects. Rebellion. Nope. That's the beast shop. There is actually a couple more houses over that way. I'll just check. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to If there's nothing there, we'll just leave and uh, start a quest. We can do Sebastian's quest. I think we get Crucio, maybe, from that quest. No chests. And it doesn't look like there's anything in here either. So... All right, we're leaving. Let's just go. We've done lots. We actually have a quest on the world map somewhere. We're just missing the astronomy table from there. All right, let's just go to a quest. We've been doing a lot of exploring. It's time to quest up just a little bit. We need to go to the astronomy wing and talk to... Oh, we need to talk to... Oh, uh, the Hall of Hero... Or Hero Diana. Uh... Yeah, I guess we could. It's my least favorite of the puzzles in the game. It's a DePulso and Accio related puzzle. We have to like move blocks around to try and reach certain things. It is not my favorite in the world. Can I help you? I believe you can. I'm Sophronia, by the way. And I need help from someone who's at least a fifth year. Are you familiar with Herodiana Byrne? Don't answer that. Of course you're not. No one seems to know of her but me. She's only the single greatest Depulso master of all time. Even taught at Hogwarts, briefly. Doesn't sound that impressive. She was just good at casting a spell. No wonder I've never heard of her. Perhaps you didn't <laughs> hear me. I said, the single greatest Depulso master of all time. I often read about great witches in my limited free time. There are many. Whilst reading about her, I learned that she built a secret Depulso training room here at Hogwarts. Two, actually. But in typical clever Herodiana fashion, 
One cannot access it unless one knows De Pulso, which, of course, third years aren't taught. And you're a third year, so... Quick one, aren't you? According to what I've read, her signature outfit may still be there. I would love to see it. Would you get Herodiana's signature outfit and show it to me? What did she do? How did Herodiana Byrne become famous by casting De Pulso? She once saved orphans from a wild graphhorn by banishing it over Stonehenge. That's on Salisbury Plain. She once banished a meddlesome dark wizard all the way to Durmstrang while she was in the Alps. I doubt that. That one may have been exaggerated, but lots of the stories about her certainly aren't. What happened to her? What ends up happening to Herodiana Byrne? In her later years, she taught at Hogwarts, but only for a short while. Just long enough to build a secret hall, it appears. Then one day, she just disappeared. Some say she actually banished herself. No one knows for sure. I'll see what I can do. If you tell me where to go, I'll see what I can do about it. Simply go to the Hall of Herodiana. It's at the base of the Defense Against the Dark Arts Tower. There, you'll find a series of Depulso puzzles, concealing pieces of Herodiana's ensemble. Very well. I shall let you know if I find anything. I'm like the most terrifying wizard that you could talk to about this stuff. And uh, she's like, just go help me find uh, the Pulso door. I think it's down this way I should look for that secret hall Sophronia told me about. It does sound interesting. Or, and I'm just throwing... Wait, where am I going? Am I going the wrong way? Is it further down? It must be. Okay. It's telling me to go down here somewhere. I'm going to follow the dots until it leads me there. Oh, here it is. Right. I've been here before. Where's my Depulso at? This must be the entrance to the Hall of... Herodiana. Yep, we got it. It's, uh... The Hall of Herodiana. Better go inside and find those puzzles. It's going to be an interesting one. I... I'm not great at spatial puzzles, admittedly. Alright, well, this is an easy one. Wait, is there any treasures I should know about in this room? Yes. Sometimes these rooms have treasures, and it's pretty. It's a good idea to grab them, because you won't be able to come back here, I don't think. Maybe you can, I don't know. Also, if you stand in front of them, you die. <laughs> like, if you Accio this while you're standing there, you will just die. And have to restart. Why do I keep casting that? That was actually really close. Alright. We got to the Herodianus Cape. Next puzzle. Revelio. There's a reset button. There's a chest over there. Which I do want. And how do I go about getting that chest is the question. If I go there, 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 that doesn't help me. If I put that one there. That way, that way. That would stop it there, but that doesn't help me either. What if I go out? No, what if I go over? Or what if I go there? There. There, there, there. Okay, maybe I got an idea. Okay. Isn't exactly where I thought it lined up to. Alright. Better plan. Oh, yeah, no, it's fine. We're good. We're still good. Stop doing that. Okay, now I need to move this guy. There, there. Oh, I see. I just did a dumb. This is fine. Accio. 
Join those two. Goes that way. Goes there. Jump across, grab loot. Send over there. I guess I could have stood on that wallet. I wonder if I could have, actually. I think you can. I absolutely could have stood here and just apostled it and sent myself flying too. Would have saved me several moments. Two puzzles completed. Just one left. Alright, let's go. Let me climb up on this rock so I can see what my situation's looking like here. There we go. Alright, we got a cliff. Got a chest there. Actually, I think we can just grab this chest, honestly. Oh, we can't. Okay. Well, it's worth a shot. Maybe you can. I'm gonna try something here. Nah. Kinda wanna try that jump one more time, though. I think you could jolly just. No, you're just not allowed to do that? Okay, fine. Alright, let's figure this puzzle out then. What do we got? We got a tour. Just a tour? That's it? Is there no more pieces? So if I go which way? There? Nope. If I go over, there, there, there. That doesn't help. If I go there. No. It's there, there. Can't fit through there, so that's not useful at all. I need to get it down this corridor here somehow. Alright. Are those all centered? No, it looks like they're not. Actually, okay. I got it. We go there, 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 there. Gotcha. Alright. Let me go here. Oops. Send it over there. Jump over here for a sec. Gotta go there, there, there. That actually doesn't help us, never mind. Hmm. Can't make that jump, I need to get it over. You know what we can do? We got the treasure. Which I'll move this back. Reset everything. Good to know. Do that. What have I done? Something very stupid, that was not what I meant to do. We need to go... Oops. That one... And then there and there. And then we just come over here. Reset it. Put that there. Jump up, and we're done. That wasn't bad That's at the all. Last of them. Seems I was a map for Heridiana, but this must be the last piece of Heridiana's ensemble. We got the ensemble. It's remarkable. No wonder Sophronia wants to see this. How mean can we be to Sophronia? Such a long way to get back to the Ravenclaw place. Or the Starmy Tower? Whatever this is. Either one. Just when I think I've learned how to get the right Sophronia, I solved all the puzzles in the Hall of Herodiana. Incredible! Then you found Herodiana's outfit. May I see it? 
No, you should have found it for yourself. You were right about how spectacular it is. Which is why it's a pity <laughs> you didn't find it yourself. You double-crossing cur. I can't believe I told you about the Hall of Herodiana. <laughs> oh, I should have waited and done it myself. It would have only been two more years. You don't deserve to possess such an invaluable and historic <laughs> outfit. We are the worst person in the world. We're not evil. Kind of. We're just kind of a dick. Because none of these things are going to have like lasting concerns. Like She's not going to go to her grave wondering what this outfit looked like. Probably. Well, maybe she will. But we didn't like murder her family in front of her. But we're just an asshole. Just straight up to everyone in this game. We also haven't gotten all the field guide pages for Hogwarts, but I don't feel like doing that right now. There's a lot of them that we haven't gotten. Ugh, it's so many. Anywho, let's see what we've got going on over in Feldcroft. That's where we're supposed to meet. Oh, right, we were on our way there when we ran into a million Merlin trials and stuff. I guess we're going to do that still this time. I know that we kind of took a detour from that, but uh, you can only do so many Merlin trials in one day. I've been playing a single player version of this too with my wife and uh, did all these collectible things. And it just kinda you don't want to do it again, but I'm gonna do it again. But I don't want to. But I will. But I don't want to. All right, let's go pop some balloons and then we'll do a Merlin trial. And then there's two more balloons down there too. I do like the balloon ones, to be honest. Flying through the balloons is kind of fun. Also, I've come to the determination that we need just so many collectibles to get the collectible achievement. Oh, there's a lot of enemies here. What do you have in store for me this time? Oh my god, can I put Trificus to tell us like four people? Oh, they moved. Trificus to tell us. That would have been so fun if they were all in a little line. There's also a collection chest here, so... You're not alone. Shit. Excuse me. Gotta run. We're taking the high road. Woo! Hello there. Hi, goblins. I'm afraid that I think that's the end of your... Your blood's on Ranrock's hands. You didn't kill them. I mean, technically, I think you did, but... Revenue. You weren't supposed to have killed them. This is supposed to be the non-violent way of killing them by paralyzing them forever until fluid fills their lungs and they die. Not at all horrible. Alright, let's go. We gotta jump up these. This shouldn't be too hard. Just gotta do some parkour. Oh. Excuse me. Really? <laughs> okay, let's just blow it up then. I expected the Depulsa to knock off more than one balloon. Ooh, or one, one barrel. That's that. Settled. Okay, where are we off to now? Possibly to take a break, because I'm a little bit tired now. It's been it's been a long day. I'm not going to lie. Today's been a hard day. We're going to do one more Merlin trial, and then we'll call it. We're getting closer to being done stuff. It's just, there's a lot to do in this game. There's a lot of collectibles to deal with. More specifically, there's a lot of, like... Oh! It's a pleasant surprise. It suffers a little bit from Assassin's Creed Syndrome. Where they just jam the map with so much shit that you have to deal with that you just kind of like, I don't really want to find all of the areas of interest or vantage points or whatever. I'm missing one, where is it? Or possibly two. There it is down there. Confringo! There we go. Alright, I'm going to call it here. Like always, if you have any suggestions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, we'll see you next time, and we will continue on our way. This time, we will for sure head to Veldcroft to deal with the Undercroft thing. But we did some puzzles today, and that was fun. Take care. See you next time.